just one leaf that's all there is now and my last hope good morning all the peaceful souls as today we have english subject enrichment activity scheduled i believe everyone is ready well uh, it seems already avni's group is ready to present a role play good morning one and all present here my name is avni hiria and i am going to present an act on the topic lastly why or hindi with my friends manisha as john sian berman nitya shu and jay as doctor so here we begin is anything worrying john c no but why do you ask see it seems has made up her mind that she is not going to get well if she doesn't want to live medicines will not help her after some time she heard john c whisper something then nine eight seven she saw an old ivy creeper shedding its leaf what is it dear six They are falling faster now. Three days ago, there were almost a hundred leaves. There are only five left now. It is autumn, and the leaves will fall. When the last leaf falls, I will die. Oh, that's nonsense. The doctor is confident you will get better. You went and bought her a bowl of soup. No, no, I don't want any soup. I'm not hungry. She sat on Johnson's bed and said, "No, you're not going to die. Try to sleep. Till then, I will call Bowman up to be my model." She rushed down to Bowman, who was a 60 years old painter, whose lifelong dream was to paint a masterpiece. She poured out her worries to Bowman. That's crazy. How can she think like that? Oh yeah, she is suffering from high fever and she has refused to eat or drink anything. I will come with you and see Johnsy. They tiptoed into the room. Johnsy was sleeping. There was only one leaf left on the creeper. She drew the curtains together. It seemed that the leaf would fall any moment now. Next morning, Johnsy asked Sue to draw the curtains. Wow, look Johnsy, there is still one leaf left. It looks quite green and healthy. I thought it would have fallen. It will surely fall today. When I will die. In the evening, there was another storm, but the leaf did not fall. Sue, please forgive me. I have been a bad girl. The last leaf has shown me how wicked I have been. You took care of me so lovingly, but I did not cooperate with you. The doctor came. Johnsy is feeling positive now. Johnsy now has the will to live. I am confident she will recover soon. Now I must go downstairs and see Berman. He is also suffering from pneumonia, but I am afraid there is no hope for him. The next morning she came and sat on Johnsy's bed. Um I have something to tell you. Mr Berman died of pneumonia this morning. He was ill for only 2 days but He was out that stormy night. His clothes and shoes were wet, and he was shivering. Then they found a ladder and lantern still lying near his bed. There were also green and yellow paint on the floor near the ladder. John C. Dear, look out of the window. That I believe is Bowman's masterpiece. He painted it last night. Well, that was very beautifully enacted, as well as very. well narrated so we all can give them a big round of applause